flowers. Yes, you're looking at flowers. So here I have a little poem that I'm going to share with you. Right. And it is called Five Little Flowers. Right? And it says, Five little flowers grow in a row. The first one says, I am purple, you know. The second one says, I am pink as pink can be. The third one said, I am blue like the sea. Good job. The fourth one said, I am a very red fellow. Right? And the fifth one said, my color is yellow. Right? Then the sun came out big and bright. And the five little flowers smiled in delight. Should we do that again? Let's do it one more time. Five little flowers, five little flowers growing in a row. The first one said, I am purple, you know. The second one said, I am pink as can be. And the third one said, I am blue like the sea. The fourth one said, I am a very red fellow. And the fifth one said, my color is yellow. And then the sun came out big and bright. And the five little flowers smiled in the light. Right. Do you remember any of the colors? One was red. Good job. How about the others? Yes, I heard you purple, yellow, and red. Good job. And how about blue? One was blue like the sea. Good job for remembering. So those are the colors of the of the flowers in the poem, right? How about, what, can you remember if there were any rhyming words like yellow and fellow? Yes, there was. And how about bright and delight? Yes. And how about row and no? Right, all of those words sound the same. So they were rhyming words because they sound the same. Right, so for this part of our activity, we will be making a little garden. Yes, we'll be making a little garden of our own. So we, put, we, we will be putting flowers in our garden. So for this part of the activity, you will need some leaves, some flowers, so we can either cut them out wrong or we could use a sponge. So I am going to sponge paint mine. We're going to need some crayons. And we're going to need, we're going to need a picture of a little butterfly. And I have a sponge butterfly. So I'm going to sponge paint mine too. Are you ready? Let's do this activity and let's make our little garden. So here I have my red paint. I'm just going to put my first flower and we're going to sponge paint it in red. So there we go. I have my first one is red. Then I have another color. And this one is going to be Orange. We need it to be a little bit more. 
So I need the orange to be a little bit more brighter. Okay, so my paper can only fit two. So for the bottom, I'm going to be using my crayon and I'm going to be drawing the grass. I'm going to be coloring the grass for my flowers because you want them to be in the garden. And in the garden, we also have grass, right? Of course we do. Okay, we need to sing a song while we're doing this. Have you got a song that we could sing? If you're happy and you know it. Okay, let's go. If you're happy and you know it, let's draw a garden. If you're happy and you know it, let's draw a garden. If you're happy and you know it, and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, let's draw a garden. There you go, so I have my cross and I am going to do my my butterfly and my butterfly is going to be the color yellow. So you know butterfly has got lots of colors, right? Yes, the butterfly isn't just uh, one color. So I'm going to tap this make our butterfly nice and colorful. And I'm going to put my butterfly right at the top here. So it looks like it's flying. Wow. Okay, so here we have my butterfly and my trees and my grass. But what's missing? Our sky! Yes, so we need to put our blue sky. So here we're going to need a blue crayon for our blue sky. Or you could paint it. What do you think? Yes, I do my paint. So here I'm going to paint my sky blue. I'm just going to paint my sky nice and blue. So we see the butterflies flying in the sky. And it's a lovely day. It's a lovely day. So here we go. This is something that you can try at home. And it will be your art. It will be your painting. And you know what you could do? You could get mommy or daddy or if you have a big sister or brother or even grandma to write your name on the back. And guess what? This drawing belongs to you. And this drawing is special because it is yours. Yes, it is. It is yours. So because it is yours, it is very, very, very special. All right? Did you enjoy your activity today? Yes, I love doing art and craft. And I also like to get my hands messy. Yes. Great job. Great job. So now that we've done our art and our craft and we spoke about the colors in the poem and what else do we do today we play in sand that got our hands really messy right and we play with the blocks and what else do we do we sang a few songs right gracie 
right? We sang a few songs and we talk about our Gracie, you know what I forgot? We talked about our eyes, our nose, and our mouth. And what game did we play, Gracie? Peekaboo, right? We played the peekaboo game too. So I guess what, boys and girls? I want you to get a seat. I want you to get really comfortable because we are going straight into our story time. Yes, we've got story time. So sit down, I need to move this over. I want you to sit down and I want you to get really comfortable. And we are going to go right into our story time. Okay, so the title of our book today is Bumblebee, Bumblebee, do you know me? Right, and it's by Anne Rockwell, right? Bumblebee, Bumblebee, do you know me? Do you know Bumblebee? Have you ever heard of a Bumblebee before? Not sure? Okay, so now we're going to read a story about a Bumblebee. And here we have a bumblebee. This is what a bumblebee looks like. Yes. Okay. Bumblebee, bumblebee. Do you know me? Yellow and green. I wave to the breeze to say that spring is here. Yes. This picture is a picture of a daffodil. And a daffodil is a flower. Butterfly, butterfly. Do you know me? Do you know butterfly? Yes, we put one in our picture just a while ago. Right, so we have a butterfly. Here I stand tall and straight while my silky cup catches rain. Right. And here we have, this is a picture of a tulip, which is also a flower. Right, I we put some flowers in our garden. And this one is a pink one, like the poem that says, I am pink as pink can be. Right, you remember. Over here, we have June bug. The name of this book, and we would say, June bug, June bug. Do you know me? My leaves point like swords, and my petals wave like flags. And this flower, the name is Iris. That's the name of this flower, and it is purple with white. Right. Did you hear the, white, the rhyme there? Purple and white, right? So, right and white, right. Good job, words that sound the same. Here we have a cricket. Cricket, cricket, do you know me? Watch me pop open. See my tiny black seeds. And do you know what flower this is? This flower is called a puppy. And this puppy is what color? Red. Right, this is a red fellow. Good job. And here we have a ladybug. Do you know ladybugs? I'm sure you do. Okay, so we have ladybug, ladybug. Do you know me? My thorns are prickly, but my blossoms are soft. Do you know what flower this is? Yes, I am a rose. And this is a flower called a rose. And it is pink with a little bit of red. Spider, spider, do you know me? Have you seen a spider? Yes, we have. 
We all, sorry, we come in many colors and we turn our faces to the summer sun. Then we have leaf hopper, leaf hopper. Do you know me? You find me at breakfast when my blue trumpet greets the day. I am the morning glory, and that's the name of the flower. Okay, now we're getting to the end of our story. Yes, we are. Okay, here we go. So we said, okay. so of course, all right, so here we have a flower. Do you know what flower this is? Not sure? I'm sure they're going to tell us. Let's see. Of course I know you, she said. Sunflower, I know all the flowers I see. Right. So in this book, we have, we have lots of flowers. And in our poem, we spoke about different flowers and their colors. So, do you remember some of the colors we had? We had red, good job, what else? Yellow, right? Which other one? Pink, fantastic. Which other one? Blue. And we had pink. Did I see pink? Right. So we have we have had lots and lots and lots of flowers. And did you see the bumblebee? Yes, so did you know the bumblebee? Right, we call it a bee. Right, but our book was about the bumblebee. Bumblebee, bumblebee, do you know me? And guess what? It was fun reading to you boys and girls. Yes, it was. Did you enjoy our story time? I did too. I did too. So guess what? We're going to sing a little song. Before we do that, what was your favorite flower? Which flower did you like? The rose? Okay. I heard somebody say sunflower. All right. And the first one, the first one was the daffodil. Right. Give yourself a big hug. Hug yourself. Woo hoo hoo. Ooh, ooh. Right, so we talked about the flowers and we talked about the different colors, right? All right, so guess what? When later on or tomorrow, you're going to tell your parents about the flower that you like, right? So you have to talk to them about the color. And guess what? You can, you can share your story with mommy and daddy too. Yes, you can say, Auntie read me a story about flowers and they had different colors, right? Or the poem. I'm going to say the poem for you one more time just to remind you of the colors. Ready? Five little flowers growing in a row. The first one said, I am purple, you know. The second one said, I am pink, pink as can be. The third one said, I am blue like the... C, good job. The fourth one said, I am a very red fellow. And the fifth one said, my color is yellow. Then all came the sun, big and bright. And the five little flowers smiled in delight. How many flowers? Five, good job, sorry. Five flowers smiled in the light. All right, boys and girls, well done. So today we've come to the end of our session or activity for today and we had so much fun, right? I did. I enjoyed being here with you today. So I guess what, boys and girls, 
COVID is still around. Yes, it is. So you have to remember to wash your hands, sanitize your hands, and we have to stay home, right? But guess what? While you're at home, guess what you can do? Yes, tell mommy and daddy that you want to watch more activities like these. Yes, tell mommy and daddy that you want more. And where can we find it? At www.ecc.gov.jm. And that's where we can find lots more activity like these, right? And please, please remember that children under the age of two should have no screen time at all and those that are between the ages of three to five years old should only have one hour of screen time per day all right we have lots more activities like this you can find them on the website and you can go there and you can have lots and lots and lots more fun yes you can all right Know that you've done all of that. Boys and girls, please remember to wash your hands. Please remember to sanitize. Please remember to, even after you use the bathroom, to wash your hands. After you have eaten, wash your hands. Please, please, please remember to wash your hands with? Yes, with soap. We wash our hands like soap. With soap, and we wash between our fingers, and we wash on the back of our hands, and everything like that, all right? Okay, so now that we've done that, guess what? We're going to do a little sing along. So, this is where you have to come and you have to sing with me. Are you ready? All right, so let's go. In the windy spider, climb up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the instruments is by the plant of the spouts again. Did you use your fingers? Did you do the actions? Let's go again. Instruments is by the plant of the water spouts. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Up came the sun and dried up all the rain. The itsy bitsy spider climb up the spout again. Gracie, did you enjoy today's session? You did? What was your favorite part? Playing in the sand? Okay, 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 okay. Now that we've done that, guess what, Gracie? We have a book. I guess what's in this book? Another song. Are you ready, Gracie? Okay.